want to do this so bad. And I was starting putting up the rings for Paul Morton when I was just 12 years old in Paducah, Kentucky, and I worked. I did everything from cleaning the arenas to popping the popcorn to putting up the ring. But I finally got my chance. Well, next Saturday night is July the 28th, 2012. This young man right here in this orange shirt, he's been waiting a long time. Zach's going to get his opportunity to climb into the squirrel. Here's Zach. Thank you. Like it or not. How's everybody doing tonight? <laughs> Next week I get a chance to do something I've wanted to do since I was nine years old. I remember sitting in my living room with my mom. I turned on Monday Night Nitro. I saw a Goldberg Spear Rick Steiner. I said, I want to be a wrestler when I grow up. For six months I've been in here. Every Saturday, between working two jobs, attending college, I've been training with LT in here. Three hours a day, twice a week. I'm going up against the guy you just saw in here, Justin Granberry. You know, he's been doing this a little bit longer than me, a couple years longer than me, in fact. And I can't make a promise that I'm going to beat him, but I can make a promise if you come show some support, and help me through it, I'm going to give it the best I can possibly do. Thank you for your time. I'll see you next Saturday, hopefully. Thank you. Ten years ago, on July 28, 2012, I had my very first match as a professional wrestler against Justin Granberry for the USWO in downtown Nashville, Tennessee. Ten years later, I'm in the main event for the UCW Southern States Championship against Flynn Hendricks in Salina, Tennessee. The guy from 10 years ago would have told you that he was just happy to have his spot on the card. I'm telling you that I'm not just happy to have a spot anymore. I'm telling you that Flynn Hendricks, I'm coming to take what belongs to me. I ain't just happy to be here anymore. I'm walking out of Salina, Tennessee, the UCW Southern States Champion. And you don't have to like it, you just have to deal with it. <laughs>